Hey guys, so we have an awesome test here between the best Sony and the best iPhone. So let's see how they stack up. Now the Xperia 1 Mark II is Sony's best effort in years. It's a huge, huge improvement over last year's Xperia 1. Now for the first test, boot up. We have advantage for the Sony. And now the iPhone's up. Alright guys, now for the specs. Sony phones are the only ones with movie aspect ratios. And they're also the only ones with 4K displays. The iPhone has an extra camera on the front for face unlock. And on the back, the Sony is an extra camera, used for depth. The iPhone has more options for storage, but the Sony supports microSD. The Sony battery is slightly larger, and it also has faster charging. Both phones have the latest chipsets, while the Sony has more RAM. Both phones are water resistant. At the bottom, we have Type-C vs. Lightning port. And believe it or not, the headphone jack on the Sony. Both phones are wireless charging. And on the back, both are glass. Alright guys, let's get to it. All right, guys, get into it. Ready? Sony. eBay. Sony. Spotify. Excellent started for Sony. YouTube. Again, Sony. Instagram. Sony, iFunny, iFunny is a Sony, that's one that the iPhone almost always wins for, Amazon Shopping, again the Sony, and last basic app we have photos, alright so once again the Sony, alright so now for gaming, now the iPhone always wins for PUBG, And no exception here, we have advantage for the iPhone. Real Racing. Advantage for the Sony. And pretty easy one for it. Jump run. So pretty simplistic app here. And this one is advantage for the Sony. Transfer zombies. iPhone Alright, and now for the Begonia Fortnite Try it again, we have Fortnite Now the iPhone always takes a long time to optimize uh, After you start your iPhone So you guys are going to see it's going to optimize here 
Well, Persona's gonna connect. But yeah, let's go and fast forward. Alright, and Sony's up. And now the iPhone's up. Alright guys, so the iPhone's a lot slower if you restart your phone. So let's go and close out and go back in. Once again we have Fortnite. Alright, once again Fortnite. Yeah, so this time it's going to skip the optimization. Yep, straight to play. And the iPhone is up. And yeah, so I'll drop that time for the iPhone. But if you start your phone, then of course, a big advantage for the Sony. Alright, so now for defense. And it runs in a few. Time now for Chrome vs Safari. And it's in a quick weapon tree. I'm noticing that the iPhone is heating up, while well, the Sony's not really. Alright, so first up we have iGen.com, Sony, IND, again Sony, 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 and lastly is Apple. Alright, Apple.com. And that one's advanced for the iPhone, but overall advanced for the Sony. Underwater, no copyright. Now for the speakers. Both phones are dual speakers. So first you have the Sony. iPhone. Back to Sony. And my son now. Okay, so the iPhone definitely gets louder, but the quality on the Sony is a bit better. But yeah guys, as always, tell me your preference. Now for the fingerprint on the Sony. 
Which is also the power for space unlock for the iPhone. Yeah, so a bit quicker for the Sony. Now, when you use your thumb instead, then it's even a bigger difference for it. Time out for battery. So what is run Temple Run 2 for a few hours? Alright guys, so we're back in a few. Alright, so a few hours in. Let's go and check in. Okay, so minor bands here for the iPhone, but the Xperia 1 2 is a huge improvement over the Xperia 1. Uh, that one did pretty poorly versus the iPhone. But yeah guys, we'll be doing a full comparison in the future, so stay tuned. Alright guys, now for RAM. Now keep in mind, it's only twice as much RAM. So, first we have Reddit. Yeah, so restart here for the iPhone. eBay, Sony, Spotify, Sony, YouTube, again Sony, Instagram, yeah so restart there for uh, the iPhone. Let's not go as far back. Let's go into Amazon. Sony. PUBG. Yeah guys, if you're playing a game like that and restarts, that's definitely an issue. But yeah, excellent job here for the Sony. That one holds for both. Temperon. Excellent. Alright, so we'll do plants and then Fortnite. Plant sales for both. Good job there. And then Fortnite and then we'll do uh, Geekbench. Alright, so for Fortnite. Yeah, Fortnite holds for both. So, excellent job for the Sony and good job for the iPhone. Now for Geekbench. And let's run it. Okay, so the iPhone wins for the single, but Sony wins for multi. And of course Sony wins for RAM. Now for camera speed. All right, so pretty similar. Now for the front cameras. And the stabilization. Now for the rear cameras. And again, the stabilization.
Here's a look at the wide angle. We also have the maximum zone. All right, guys, so I'm now in the comments below which phone won. Now, for my comparison last year between the iPhone 11 and the Xperia 1, I said that that one was a tie. But for this one, I would say advantage for the 1 too. But yeah, guys, tell me your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more. And check out my review for the 1 too.